Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster and welcome back to Let's Play Wing Commander 4. Last time was an especially scary episode as we learned that the enemy is now capable of using bioweapons and adjusting the human genetic code to destroy its enemies. That's just scary. Oh my gosh. That body we found was just... Ugh. Well, if you go over to the storage hold, we see Sosa. It looks like there's some candles or something in the background. I don't know if she sees us. I wish I could light a candle for everyone on that planet. And fill up a space a lot bigger than this, that's for sure. Fill up a whole planet. You know, in all the years that they killed Rothy War, I don't think I've ever heard of anything so hideous. The pinpoint killing of the innocent. The wrong DNA strand becomes a death sentence. There's no other word for it. If I'd got down to that planet with you, would I be dead too? Would anybody be lighting a candle for me? That is a seriously disturbing thought. I don't even want to think about it. If any one of us had gone down to that planet, would they be dead? Well, anyways, there's Maniac. Maybe he can... Well, I don't know. Oh, not bad. Uh, we received a series of transmissions. Secret data. Ah, no. Alright. Where's Sosa? <laughs> What are you doing? Well, I'm a pilot. I don't see a flight stick on this thing. No, this message came in a few minutes ago. And I... Recently, we've been able to link certain elements together. Perhaps we should have tumbled on this during our troubles in the Paleo system. But looking at that again, along with your position when you recently acquired those unmarked fighters, made us go back and examine other recent hotspots. Some complex triangulations have brought us to the calm at the center of the storm. And its name is Axius. Been there, done that. Nothing in Axius. Still an educated guess when all is said and done. But accompanying this transmission is everything we have on the Axius system. It's barren, unpopulated, desert planets. Perfect place to stage a massive force. And we picked up one report of a rather large capital ship moving into the system. Good luck in your investigations. I'm telling you, it's a wild goose chase. If you want to kill some time before things get hot. Axios, here we come. Not quite. Set our coordinates to the system closest to Axios. Yes, sir. We're not all going in until I see what's there. Hmm, Blair's got something up his sleeve. And who let that idiot maniac near a computer, anyway? <laughs> Okay, well, as we're jumping out, three. Ah, the Kalamakis system. Be the closest to Axios, I guess. Fair enough. All right. Anything else we can do on the ship? Nope, not really. Let's find out what we're gonna do here. to just outside the Axios system because I don't want to risk this entire ship. It makes me nervous when it looks like no one's home. Lieutenant, what does Wilford's data tell us? Uh, planets are uninhabitable, so forces would be space-based, but there's a lot of comets, space debris floating through the system, so they would still have to be pretty mobile. Well, these new fighters, can't you just go in guns blazing and take them by surprise? And with no idea what's on the other side, that's typical marine tactics. For once, I agree with Hawk. We have to recon first, see what they've got. Right, right. Now that's why I want a pair of wingmen to escort me to the jump point leading into the system. They'll peel off, and I'll go in solo. If I'm alone in one of their unmarked ships, I shouldn't attract too much attention while I snoop around. Do you know what wartime protocol is for captured spies, Colonel? Huh? 
You only live once, right? All right, let's go. Typical marine behavior saved your flight by many times. Outside. Squabble, squabble, squabble. Ugh. All right, let's load our ship here. Boy, does that Starburst bomb suck. Guess that's why it was still a testing. Well, I've been tinkering a bit and made it more useful. Instead of bursting all over the place, it all blows forward in a cone shape, like some big shotgun. Someone's gonna ship. Eh, I'm still not, still not gonna use it. I like my image racks and leech missiles. That works just fine. All right, configure our wing. I'll take Maniac. He was the first one to show up. Why not? And since Panther wasn't arguing with anybody, we'll take her too. All right, very good. How's our kill scores doing, by the way? I haven't even checked in a while. All right, I'm at the top of the kill board. 108. All right. Giggity, giggity. All right, let's fly the new dragon. Okay, simple enough. All right. Uh, let's see if everything looks going good. Switch over my tachyon gun. All right, let's head over to the Axios jump point. Aha! Uh -huh. Looks like it's some dragons. They're ready for us. Alright. See if we can shoot these bad boys down. Let's see how the Tachyon handles against uh, one of its own kind. Nah, it's alright. I'll just shoot this thing down because I can't. Okay. Nice! That'll work. Good job, Tachyon Gun. All right, we'll finish up with this last dragon. It's going to take a second to come back from Cloak, and then I'll be right back once it's done. All right, got it. It tried to Cloak, but it fit. All right, moving right along then. They're making a run for the jump point, Colonel. No telling who they'll alert on the other side. Oh, crap. We got to take them out there. Great formation and open fire. They're going to wish they were never born. Yeah, we need to take these things. Great formation and open fire. Moving in. Yeah, we got to take these things out quickly. Because if we don't, they might uh, uh, reach the jump point. And that would be very bad. Come on. Yeah, we got to let some missiles go. Right, so make the jump, got them. You're on your own from here. Look. Oh. All right. Starbase we've located orbiting the second planet in Axion. Now we've just detected it through the jump point, and one thing's for sure, this thing is way too big for you to try and take on by yourself. So we're assuming you'll be attempting to slip it quietly without opening fire and land there. Good luck, Colonel. Wow! I'm gonna get to land on this ship? Well, let's jump out of here then. All right, very good. Uh, okay, everything seems well and good. They don't seem to see me. Okay, let's head over there then. Need identification algorithm for clearance. Uh oh. Uh, don't really know what to say here. Hopefully, I'll push the right one. Will I push the right one? You're gonna have to wait till next time to find out. Until then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Take care, y'all.